In today's lesson, we will overview machine learning and related key concepts like artificial intelligence, deep learning, and data science. What is machine learning? Machine learning is a field where machines learn to do a task without being explicitly programmed to do so. How we do this? We train machines using past data or past knowledge. Let's see what is the difference between traditional programming and machine learning. In traditional programming, we have the data and we will write the program or the rules, then we will pass it to the machine to give us the output. In machine learning, we invert this methodology. We will make the computer learn those rules from the data and the output. The machine will understand the rules or the program hidden in the data by itself. Machine learning applications can be divided into three types, supervised learning, unsupervised learning, and reinforcement learning. Let's start with supervised learning. It is called so because data given are labeled. In this dataset, we find different features of tumors and the class of each one, whether it is benign or malignant. In this case, we have a supervised machine learning because we have labeled classes for each row of data. Each row is called a record. In supervised learning, we have mainly two types, classification and regression. The main difference is that in classification, we have categories as labels, and in regression, we have continuous values as labels. For example, predicting house prices is a regression problem because price is a continuous value. And predicting whether an image is for a dog or a cat is a classification problem because cat and dog are categories. Let's move to unsupervised learning. This is used data that are unlabeled, which means each record or row is not associated with a specific class. Here is an example of unlabeled data. We have this customer's data set. Each row represents information about a customer without a specific label or a class. Unsupervised learning is used in data analysis to identify hidden patterns. Also, it is used in dimensionality reduction to reduce computing time and data storage. Let's pass to the third type of machine learning, reinforcement learning. Reinforcement learning is a feedback-based technique where we have an agent and an environment. The agents perform actions on this environment. In reinforcement learning, there is no predefined data, unlike supervised and unsupervised learning. The agent will get a positive feedback or a reward for a good action, and the negative feedback a penalty for a bad action. The agent is learning by experience and not by labeled data. Reinforcement learning is used mainly in game developments and robotics, like self-driving cars, where decision-making is sequential. Let's see an example. In this example, we want our agent to reach the diamond in block S4. The agent will interact with the maze until it will reach the diamond and then it will get a reward. If it reached the block S8 or the block of the fire, it will get a penalty. And through this experience, the agent will learn how to win the maze. Now, let's see the difference between artificial intelligence, machine learning, data science, and deep learning. There is a relationship of inclusion between those four terms. 
AI or artificial intelligence is an umbrella discipline that covers everything related to making machines smarter. In the other hand, machine learning is a subset of AI or artificial intelligence that solves tasks by learning from data. Deep learning is a subset of machine learning that mimics the human brain and uses artificial neural networks to solve problems. This is an example of neural networks. It consists of an input layer, hidden layers, and an output layer. The last term is data science, which is a multidisciplinary field that uses different tools from artificial intelligence, machine learning, and deep learning to study the data and extract meaningful information from those data. Machine learning applications are used in every sector, in finance, healthcare, and education. Siri and Google Assistant are some examples of machine learning applications. Another example of machine learning is object detection. The model detects what type of object exists in the image, like here we have person, cars, and tracks. Customer segmentation is an application of unsupervised learning. In customer segmentation, we try to map a product or a service with the appropriate audience. Another example is fraud detection in the finance sector. We can detect fraudulent credit card activities by learning from past data. Another widely used application is recommendation systems. This is an example of a recommendation system used by Amazon. They study your past data on the website to recommend you products you may like or purchase. If you have a question, or a suggestion, you can leave it in the comments below.